Hi guys, welcome back with Learning on the Job with City of Portales. I'm here with Public Works Director John D. Deshay, and he's going to tell us about some dumpster problems we're having in the city. Hi. Uh, as you can see, we have a problem with illegal dumping all throughout the city. This is a pretty good example of a mixed group of just waste that could have been taken to our convenience center. Uh, everything from mattresses to metal, broken glass, yard waste, all of this stuff is accepted by our convenience center. Uh, this is a very serious problem for us. It uh, promotes rats and mice and uh, other type of vermin, skunks, those kind of things. And it's also a health hazard to people walking down the alley. What we're asking is that all of the citizens please use a convenience center. And I know that our citizens really like to keep their places clean. We're also asking the county citizens and people that think they can't use a convenience center to please take it over there. So um, what happens if, say, my dumpster is full? Uh, am I allowed to go down to the next dumpster on my street to throw that trash away if I can't get to the convenience center right away? Yes. Okay. Yes, you are. But large items like this bulky one needs to be taken to the convenience center. There's to be taken to the convenience center, yes. Okay. And I know that the city had at one point... Um, done special pickups and because they weren't able to because of manning are you trying to bring that back or are we doing away with that so that they can just take it to the convenience center we hope to have the special pickup program back in place soon uh, we do as part of our, our ordinance ask that if you have large bulky items that you can't take to put them directly behind your house okay and then give us a call okay perfect Hi guys, I'm here with Kevin Seals, the superintendent for Solid Waste. He's going to tell you about how much each load is if you wanted to bring stuff to the convenience center and you didn't have a water bill. Okay, you see a half a pickup is going to be $3.94 and a full pickup would be $7.88. It's $3.94 a cubic yard, which is a pickup bed is about two cubic yards. And we also take bulk trash and these. We take tree limbs that we mulch up, and we have a place for a metal. The only thing we don't take is anything with Freon. Refrigerators, freezers, nothing with Freon. Okay, and as you can see, when um, we take the mulch, what we do is we take it to the, um, to the waste. Wait, 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 wait. Waste, thank you, Kevin, to the wastewater treatment plant, and they'll put it in their compost that they bake out there, and then then we're also able to recycle um, the metal that you guys bring in. Um, there's spots for just your everyday trash, so it doesn't have to be big bulky items. It could just be you had a couple trash bags, and instead of getting a fancy coffee in the morning time, you just bring your trash here and pay. Um, or you can bring your water bill, and then you wouldn't have to pay, right? Right. And we do know that if you have um, fire extinguishers, that Ed's Recycling will take them for you. Hi guys, I'm at the Convenience Center here. I just wanted to show you that not everybody in town dumps illegally. As you can see, these gentlemen here are doing it correctly. They're taking all their garbage and junk and they brought it to the Convenience Center. And look, they're just tossing it out. They're doing it the right way. Hi guys. Uh, I'm here just one block east from the convenience center and this pile of rubbish and debris is so bad and it's just again one block from the convenience center. Here I'm going to point out um, these are shingles or don't quote me on that um, but we will not take this at the convenience center but this small thing would have even fit in the back of a car a trunk and you could have taken it to Clovis on your way over to Albertsons. We do not take tires, but we, if you call up City Hall, we do have a number for the state and they will help you with your tire uh, disposal. Or you could take it to a tire shop. Um, we would take this bulky item, this disgusting carpet we would take. All of the rest of this stuff, the convenience center would have taken. Um, we want the citizens of Portales to take pride in their town and we want to look good for when people do come and visit our town and um, we want people to respect their space and respect other people's space. The convenience center is open from 
eight thirty to four thirty um, during the week, and then eleven to four thirty on the weekend. So it's open seven days a week. Um, it was closed for a little bit, um, but now we've reopened at normal business hours. So feel free to take all your junk to the convenience center.